Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel it for you Today we are going to discuss how to create a window effect by using Adobe Photoshop. This will be very interesting and simple to create. For this we first need to go to Adobe Photoshop. Here I have an image in which I am going to create a window effect. So, firstly I am going to create a new file. You can choose the width and height according to your requirement. Now I am going to select rectangle tool. And will create some small boxes that will look closely like to a window. You can also follow the steps while I create the boxes. Here I have created a box, now I am gonna make its copies. By the help of move tool I am going to create its copies. To copy the box, press alter with mouse click and drag it beside the box. Your box will be easily copied. Now I am going to do this few more times. Now, to save the time, I am going to select all four boxes and will make their copies below. So here we go, I have created some boxes which closely looks like the shape of window. Now I am going to merge all these boxes. For this I am going to select the box on the top then, press and hold shift key, scroll down to the last box and click on it. So now all the boxes are selected. Now click Ctrl plus E to merge all the layers of boxes. Now press Ctrl plus T to resize the boxes. And right click from the mouse and select perspective. Now follow the step to adjust its angle. Here we go, now we have adjusted its dimension according to window shadow look like. After adjusting according to the requirement press OK to confirm the transformation. Now go to the filter on the top menu bar and look for the blur. Then look for the Gaussian blur in the drop down menu of blur and click on it. Now select convert to smart object. Here you can enter the radius according to size and pixel of your canvas. I am selecting 25 according to my requirement. Now press OK. Now select rectangle marquee tool. Create a selection around the object you have created. Now go to the edit button on top menu bar and look for the Define Brush preset. Here you can enter your desire name. I am entering here Window Effect. And click OK. Now go to the image file, look for the brush menu in top menu. Then look for the brush you have just created. Select its size according to your image. Now select the mode to overlay and the opacity according to your requirement. Here I have set the opacity to default 100%. Now select the brush color to white. Now set the cursor where you need the window effect and left click from the mouse once on it. Your window effect will be created on the image. Hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. For more related videos comment us on comment box. And must subscribe the page. Have a nice day.